Hi and welcome to the Link Expert Podcast. My name is Mina and welcome. Uh, this isn't going to be a regular podcast episode. I'm just doing a quick video to announce some prize winners. Um, I've had some prize winners to announce since the end of May. So um, it's been it's been two weeks now and I kind of really wanted to hop on here really quickly and just announce some prize winners for you guys. Um, so you guys can get in touch and I can get these out in the mail to you as soon as possible. Um, I have been planning on recording a regular podcast episode today, but things have just not worked out that way so far. Um, and I don't think I'm going to get around to it today, but hopefully, most definitely, I will have one by Friday. It might not be up to quite late on Friday, but I will definitely be able to film one on Friday. Um, and yes, yeah, so today's Wednesday, Wednesday the 14th of June. And uh, yeah, I've been a bit MIA recently. I did my last podcast feels like weeks ago now, it must be like three, three, four weeks, three weeks ago I think. Um, and the reason why there's been a gap since then is because my brother came to visit for about two and a half weeks and um, you might be able to hear Layla, she's playing on her play mat next door. And um, oh, there you go, someone's come to say hi. Um, and yeah, so my brother was over for a couple of weeks and then my mum came over as a surprise as well while my brother was here. So things were a little bit busy and I really didn't have the time to sit down and just sort of gather everything together and chat to you guys and have a proper podcast. As you can probably see from the corner of this bag here, I have all of my stuff set up ready to podcast. Like I said, I plan to do that today, but I'm pretty sure I'm not going to get around to it. I have too many other things I need to get done that take priority right now. Um, so, okay, enough rambling, on to prizes. So I have quite... She's fine. She's just playing. Um, she's getting very chatty lately, so every now and again she'll start chattering away to herself. Um, hey. And um, right, so I have prizes to announce for the Knitting Expat Designs year-long knit along, which I have running in my Ravelry group as well, um, as well at the moment. Um, so that's running until the end of the year, as the name suggests. It's year long, and it's any of my designs. Um, are eligible and I draw prizes from that every two months so now we're drawing prizes from the end of May and next set will be drawn at the end of uh, July for this and I have a bunch of prizes <laughs> I've got two physical prizes and two pattern prizes to give out okay who goes seriously with the tail <laughs> all right so the first prize I have to give out is this set of yarn from O Loops it's their stitch surfer set in the sparklers colorway and uh, Hugo's coming up to sniff. No, Hugo! <laughs> okay, so I drew for the prizes from um, entry number 298 to 512, so that's 215 entries. So that's from when I last drew, so from the end of um, March until the end of May. Um, and the winner of this, of these yarns, is number 401 Kat Majur I think I'll put the names up on the on the on the screen for you guys and she knit a pair of Avenue socks so congratulations if you can get in touch with me with your name and your mailing address let me know that you've seen this and I will get this out to you as soon as I can sorry I'm a little bit rusty and a bit all over the place and I'm trying to get this done as quickly as possible um so yeah Kat Majur if you can get Majur I'm sorry I don't know how to pronounce your ravelry name um Jeez, I'm getting cat fluff in my eyes now. <laughs> Hugo's just not letting up. Um, <laughs> please get in touch. Uh, the next prize package I have is this wonderful set of project bag and oh, this wonderful skein of yarn from Wolf and Schaefer. Lovely Magdalena from, Wolf and Schaefer, from the Wolf and Schaefer podcast. Seriously, Hugo. And this is in her on her due base, which is 70% baby alpaca, 30% mulberry silk. And the colorway is silver towels. Don't worry, he's not looking the yarn, he's looking my hand. The, the yarn is perfectly safe from Hugo. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to go grab her. But this is the yarn, you see how lovely and drapey it is. And the winner of this was number 329, the Crazy Sock Lady. So congratulations. Um, if you can get in touch with me, she also knit a pair of the Avenue socks. So that's that's amazing. And the Crazy Sock Lady also has a podcast by the same name, which you should definitely check out. It's a lot of fun. Um, yes, so if you can get in touch with me about that. And, okay, I'm gonna go grab Layla. I guess Layla's gonna join me for the rest of this. <laughs> she decided she didn't wanna stay on her play mat anymore. She wanted to come see it with her mummy. So, um, right, so the next, next um, 
surprise I have turned out there's a pattern and this is the Emily May shawl by Boston Jen and so she kindly gifted me a copy of the pattern and also donated a copy for the podcast and the winner for that was number 430 and that's Anna Christina 78 so congratulations and she knit a sugar plum shawl so um, I know you're a shawl knitter so hopefully you will enjoy that pattern I you don't need to get in touch with me I will just pass your name on to um, Jen who's Boston Jen and she will send the pattern on to you and I have another pattern prize to give away and that is this close to so close shawl but that's by uh, David, Davitska, Davitska, sorry, and that's Vicky. She uh, donated that, uh, she sent me a copy of that pattern and donated a copy for the podcast as well. So thank you so much for that, Vicky. It's a lovely shawl, it's a really big one, and there's multiple ways you can wear it. She's done a little video of it on um, her Instagram as well. So um, it's definitely an interesting looking shawl. And the winner of that was number 509, and that is Mag, Mag Stout. And uh, yeah, she also knit a snow day shawl. So again, I know you're a shawl knitter, so congratulations. And um, there again, I will just get in touch with Vicky directly and have her send you the pattern. Okay, so that's everything, all the prizes for the um, Knitting Expat Knit Along. And now we'll move on to the Sock Pattern Club um, Knit Along prizes. So I have the New York Sock Collection, um, which is a club. Every month I release a new sock pattern as part of that collection up until September will be the last one that's released. And at the end of each month I will do um, prize drawings from the monthly finished objects thread. And so I'll do it for each month. So the last month I drew was up till the end of April. And so now I'll do, I'll draw from the finished objects from the 1st of May to the end of May. And so that was from entries number 487 to 692 of the eligible entries. And I go based off what Ravelry tells me was the last post put in on the 31st of May. So the first post that has time stamped as being like the 1st of June, that's where the cutoff is and then that'll be for the next month. It doesn't have to be that month's pattern, it can be any of the previous month's patterns as well, that is not a problem. Um, I just ask, you know, it's just within each month is how I'm doing it. So prize number one was the, sorry I'm one-handed at the moment, it's the Lumia uh, Woolly Socks, uh, 250 gram skeins. I believe this looks like a self-striping um, colourway, so it's like oranges and greys, and this lovely big project bag to go along with it. And the winner for that prize is number 682, and that's Mud I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong. Like I said, the names will all pop up on the screen for you. So if you see your name, be sure to get in touch. And yeah, like I said, get in touch with your address and I will get that out to you as soon as I can. And the second prize is from Little Bean Loves Yarn. And this is on her Sparkle Sock Base in the Mooney colorway. And also an Inet, uh, Inet Fandango Tote Project Bag. If I can get that to open up. There we go. And that will be another prize pack package and that is going to number 566 and that's pie fairy princess so congratulations if you can also get in touch with me with your address i will package this up and get it out in the mail to you as soon as possible i'm hoping that people will get in touch with me soon and i can get these all out in the mail at the same time and the last prize i have to announce is um this lovely yarn by sinister yarns and this is in the lalo chesa colorway on her mcn base so it's got cashmere in it and this lovely deep rich purple into this sort of like hot pink and into this like blush pink at the end. It's a really lovely sort of skein and I believe this will knit up, if you do socks, this will probably give you sort of a micro striping effect um, based on the way it's dyed. And you get that along with a Loop London tote bag. Again, sorry these are all a little bit, these are all still a little bit creased after our move, um, but you know, they're unused, so they're pretty decent tote bags. Um, and so that's the last prize I have to announce, and that goes to number 513, and that's Dawn76, so congratulations. Um, like I said, all of you who have won physical prizes that I've shown here today, if you can get in touch with me with your addresses, I will get those all out to you as soon as possible. And, um, and yeah, so I will be back very soon. I have a Knit Crate video to uh, film and it's a review, so that will be coming up soon, and then later this week, hopefully, I will get a chance to sit down and do the podcast. Like I said, if I don't have a chance to do it tomorrow or later today, I'll definitely be able to get it done on Friday. So you can keep an eye out for that. Hey, little one. 
All right, so thank you so much for joining me today. I have links to everywhere you can find me online and for the Ravelry group and my designs and patterns, all that sort of stuff is linked down below um, in the description box on YouTube. And uh, yeah, so thank you very much. I hope you um, enjoyed this little video if you watched and uh, I hope to see you again soon. Take care. Bye.